Hello everyone. Some people claim to be strong and I believe there are some strong people out there. But I believe some people use the word strong in the wrong way. And you may say to me, what do you mean, Kevin? Some people may say they are strong, but I think some of those people are not really strong, but toxic. Do you understand what I am saying? Yes, toxic as in defiant for no reason, quick to argue about petty reasons, speaks poorly about people very often, selfish, stingy, plays the victim, believe they are never at fault, there are some more things, but that is toxic. You think you are strong because you say you stand up for yourself. So by cussing people out, by having, by moving in a rapid way, moving around your arms, rolling your neck, pointing your fingers, basically um, doing more than that as well, basically acting like an animal, you call that strong. I don't think it takes much restraint, restraint to say whatever is on your mind. I believe a child can do that, right? Like just say whatever is on your mind. I don't think it is too hard to give in to your anger. Like, how easy is that? I am feeling really mad. So let me push around boxes. Let me throw my keys in the air. Let me break my lamp. Let me break my phone and kick my car's window. Like, that is easy, but you think you are strong because you stand up for yourself. Let's be honest now. If you act in this way, that is not strong. Is it? That is being a child. That is immaturity. A person may speak about guns and stuff like that, and they can take a gun and do this and that. Now, how much restraint, like, I really hope this is making sense. I believe it takes restraint to hold back your feelings, to watch what you say. I believe it takes restraint to control yourself, to calm yourself down, to be able to express yourself in a calm manner. I believe it takes restraint to do those things. So a strong person 
is someone with restraint, not someone that gives that, what is that word? Not someone who easily gives into their emotions. And I am not trying to be rude, but if you easily give into your emotions, I believe you are still in the immature stages, like a childlike stage. Not trying to offend you, but I believe that is what it is. Now, you may say that, Kevin, I have the right to behave as a child, even though I am 50, 40, 60, because, you know, my mother was not there. My father was not there. I was adopted. I was neglected. No one loved me. So uh, no one taught me to grow up and blah, 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 blah. Even though the fact is you are still immature. You are still, in some ways, childlike. You say you are strong, but you are not strong. I believe based upon your words, your actions, the way you behave, it, it will show if you really have strength. With strength, I believe there comes restraint. For instance, I have the power to hurt probably I won't say most people, but quite a bit of people. I have the power to do that, but I am not going to do it. Because for one, I am a Christian. And two, I don't want to hurt people. I really don't. So those people you may see as... I guess some of those people that you may see as dorks, you may see them as uncool or uh, old school and stuff like that. Probably much of those people, or maybe should I say, maybe some of those people are really strong people. Strength is knowing when to shut your mouth. And how many people know how to do that? Honestly, strength is knowing when to speak and how to speak and what words to say and how to make peace. Of course, there are times where you may have to say some things, even though depending on who you are speaking with, it may cause conflict. So maybe some of those times maybe conflict is unavoidable i believe many people in this world are not strong many people in this world may be very aggressive maybe there are many killers in this world i can agree to that but can you really say they are truly emotionally strong? I think much of those people aren't. You may get praised by acting ignorantly. People may give you pats on the back for yelling really loudly and cussing people out. You may become popular or famous by doing very ignorant things. Those things don't make you a strong man or a strong woman. It makes you immature. And I believe immaturity is too big in this world. If you want to be strong, learn to be humble. Learn humility. Be meek. 
our example on how to be is Jesus Christ. He is strong. I really hope all of this makes sense. Let me stop here. May God bless us.